It's brilliant. We've been waiting five years. Drew Farmer is president of the Sacramento chapter of the American Outlaws, a support group for the American national soccer teams. He's also a huge Sacramento Republic Football Club fan. His group watched the big game today at Device Brewing in Midtown. Do we really care that we're going to MLS? No, because we love the club. We love soccer. Uh, we want to be extremely successful in, in whatever league we're in. At the end of the day, these soccer fans have a love for the team that sports the old glory red in the city of Sacramento. Still, they're excited for what's to come. Shops, restaurants, etc. but it brings an excitement. You're bringing in a stadium, a professional stadium, into the capital of California, and, that, and that's massive. Earlier this week, we spoke with a developer of the rail yard project on the north side of downtown and local economic leaders. If Sacramento gets an MLS team, this is where the stadium would be built, along with housing, shops and restaurants, offices, and a medical center think the downtown commons, but on a much larger scale. I think the whole community is going to be very pleased when they see the just the sheer magnitude of development that's finally going to be occurring in the rail yards after all these years. They tell us an MLS team would ignite the area, bringing more jobs and visitors to California's already booming capital city. Local business owners agree. Golden One Arena has already brought so much uh, vitality to downtown and midtown. Uh, I believe the MLS stadium is only going to bring more, uh, more businesses, more people down, uh, more excitement and enthusiasm for coming downtown, coming to Midtown. We're still just days away from what's expected to be a major announcement, but the indomitable excitement continues to grow. I could not be more excited for the Republic. All right, we can't be more excited either, but even non-soccer fans should be paying attention. It means downtown will soon be home to a $250 million stadium, plus new restaurants, stores, and housing. Now keep in mind, this is going to double the size of downtown. We haven't announced it yet, but there is another potential massive entertainment opportunity that is evaluating the rail yards right now that you know, wouldn't be as big as MLS, but it'd be one of the biggest things that have happened to the community. So success begets success, momentum begets momentum, confidence gains confidence, and development increases jobs and tax income. All right, the big announcement is set for Monday morning, followed by a block party on the Capitol Mall.